Tristram, and everybody should go and read his book, Terror on the Tube. Is this about Seven Seven Mornings? Yeah. Is this the one that looks at the angle that it was impossible for him to have done it? Absolutely impossible. And if you look, those, yeah, and who they were, are just terrible. And it's... Do you see all of this, like, because I would never have bought any of that. Well, when you... All these false flags. Oh, all of them. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have entertained all of it. It's only now that since the terrorism's gone. It's not, where's it gone? It's like... No, because it's climate change. We're it, not going to burn it, so, to death. So they used... So terrorism was used with 9-11. If you're... I, I'll go down the rabbit hole with 7 I haven't. I haven't ever done that. Um, it's absolutely was... It, you'd got... Netanyahu, you've got all these main figures from all these countries were all in London at the same time. They've done a trial. One on the of those tubes. trains was actually cancelled. It doesn't exist. The photo. It's a terrible Photoshop photo. You've got you've got um Am I right? paramedics who arrived on the scene. I did an advanced trauma and life support course with Kings Mill Hospital. And but you're not saying that people weren't blown up. You're looking at you're looking at the the metal fatigue in those carriages and the injuries that the people had and even paramedics commented on it the injuries that they had uh, uh, and their feet blown it was everything was wrong about it the way everyone was cleared out why would those three boys then make their way down to canary wharf they bought sand tickets yeah they and why did tickets. they go to canary wharf and why was everybody ordered to stay back from the windows while the three, See, if I go the, down this rubbish, while the three of them were shot in the head. Well, I read Nick Collistrom's book, Terror on the Tube, and I read it again recently because I interviewed him on TNT. Read the book. Give me a podcast with him. Yeah, yeah. No, I, absolutely. Um, read the book and make your own mind up. I will, because I have never gone down that rabbit hole, because I guess, I guess for my own... It's the rabbit hole marked MI5. Which, which, I, <laughs> which I totally, now, with everything that's gone on, wouldn't put anything past them. So by doing that terror attack, it, 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 they, they could bring in laws to take our freedoms. They could turn us all against each other. They could create us to create groups like the EDL. Or they could drive us to do things like this because of the fear of terrorism and the fear of this. I don't put anything past it now. I don't know what to believe or what to trust. Because Well, most of it. Everything's been a lot. Yeah, I just think, do, do, can I have any effect on it? No. Does it make any difference whether I believe it or I don't believe it at this stage? No. What can I do? I can try and live out of utopia. I can start growing food, learning more and more, which I do on how to make natural remedies and just live out, hopefully, because, and prep, prep. Everybody should be buying You're food. Prepping. Yeah, I am. I've even got a rocket stove. I shouldn't tell anybody they'll be around to rob it. Um, I've got a rocket stove. I mean, if the shit went down. You're right. Yeah. yeah. Come <laughs> yeah. I'm yours. Berkey, water filter, I've got it all going on. <laughs> yeah, because this, this is the problem. We're not supposed to live like this.